What's up everybody and thanks for tuning back into the channel. It's been a while since I put out my canoe on the water. I have lower winds today, sunny skies, and a chance of catching fish. I'm pretty excited. I'm gonna throw my bobber in the water and see what we A couple we get smaller tonight. bites, but no takers yet. I guarantee you there's gonna be something though. There's no doubt about it. Just gotta be patient. Oh, bite, bite, bite. Swallow it. Come on, he's there. He's there. Nibble, nibble, nibble. Oh, come on, he's swimming with it. Yeah, fish on. Fish on. Yeah. Awesome little fight from this drum. Look at that. Ooh, pulling some drag. Yay! Come on there, bye. Give it up. Didn't take long at all. And look at that awesome freshwater drum. Thick head on them, nice scales. Let's measure them up. Hey, we got about a 20 inch fish. First one of the day is a 20 inch freshwater drum. Pretty stoked on this guy. He gave me a really good fight. Couldn't be any happier. Let's get this guy back in the water, catch another one. There he goes. So early on I started out down there. I was kind of getting pushed around by the wind and found this really great inlet. Uh, just sheltered out of the wind. Fallen trees provide lots of structure. And that was first cast over there between that tree and that fallen one. And within seconds I had bites. So I paddled myself back in here and start casting and see if we can get another one. You. He's taking it. I found one. Yeah, fish on. Aw, oh, small guy, but... Right on. Yeah, number two. Woo! Come here, little boy. A little bit of a smaller drum compared to the last one. He still put up a great little fight. Couldn't be more stoked. You. Before I put them back, look at the color on these guys. Kind of like a really cool green, rainbow, blue looking thing, but yeah, let's put them back. You. Freshwater drum, also known as silver bass. Here you go, little buddy. You. It just became so calm on this river. The wind changed the direction. And all the trees are blocking. Oh, I'm in stealth mode behind the tree. There we go. Get fish on. Oh, come on, get around there. There we go, perfect. Oh, so awkward. I'm bent 180 degrees right now. Oh my god, that's awkward. I gotta turn around. There we go. I did it without losing it. Come here. Hey, nice little channel catfish. You, baby guy. Put up a great little fight, little channel catfish. I'd say he's about 12 inches big. It's tiny, he's still got lots of room to grow to be a trophy, little master angler. So let's get him back. You, and he just flops out like that, eh? Uh... Be careful when handling these uh, these catfish. They got a massive spike on each side as well as the one I'm holding on top, so. Yep. 
Not too bad of a day, eh, for being out here. Two freshwater drum and a catfish. All of them put up great fights. <sighs> this is epic. I love getting out on this canoe. It's such a treat when the weather permits. Yeah, you might not be able to tell on the GoPro, but that is an owl. I'm not too sure what kind it is. It's pretty gray. That is like, that is the coolest thing I've seen all day. Oh, did you see that? Oh my God. That was magnificent. Bob is your uncle and that thing is gone and hooked. Oh, got my rod stuck in the tree. I got a gold eye. Look at that. That, ladies and gentlemen, is a Winnipeg gold eye. Classic fish of the city. Very good, very tasty fish smoked. Winnipeg gold eye. See that? Ooh, golden eye. Pretty sweet. Fourth of the day. Thanks for tuning in on this episode of Freshwater Fishing with Adrian. Today, we landed two freshwater drum, one channel catfish, and one Winnipeg gold eye. The most classic fish of the city. Absolutely stoked and fired up. Have an awesome day, everybody. Until the next one. You.